Yo, so what's up? So today I'm going to show you how to play EFT in 4x3 stretch resolution in 2024. I'm making this video because I looked up how to do it myself and I couldn't find a proper video that explains how to do it. I end up finding this video from a guy named Eroctic. Uh, it's an old video from 2020 and he explains well in depth the aspect ratios and how the FOB works in in the game so um be shout out to him i will be referencing some of his info in the videos i still wanted to make this guy for people that is looking how to play in 4x3 in tarkov now before you click out of the video because you think yeah all i need to do is go to my settings under the graphics tab and change the aspect ratio to 4x3 and then change the resolution to the highest possible in 4x3 resolution right here well yeah, no, that's not what you want to do, and if you do it this way, you will notice some black ugly bars in the uh, edges of the screen. And what most people do to fix the black bars, they just go in here and change, change it back to the native resolution. Yeah, that's not the way you want to do it. So then you may be like, okay, so if I want to play in 4x3, how do I do it? Yeah, that's where the things get a bit more complicated so make sure to stay tuned for the entirety of the video so I can show you how to do exactly this so yeah first thing first for some of you that might not know what 4x3 resolution does it basically makes your image a little bit smaller but also makes it a little bit more zoomed in making it easier for you to like spot player models and making them bigger in general, you know? I wanna point out that this will not make it easier to kill the enemies because the most trouble and the aim will be the same regardless the the aspect ratio you are using, so. So yeah, we wanna go to, we wanna close the game, go to the desktop and right click anywhere on the screen and you will see this NVIDIA control panel option pop up. If you're using an AMD graphics card, you will have the uh, AMD software option here instead and the process are pretty much the same so don't really worry about it if none of these options of NVIDIA or AMD pop up that means that your graphics card drivers are not installed properly so go to your um, GPU web page and install the latest drivers but yeah anyway right click anywhere in the desktop and click on NVIDIA control panel so once we are here, we want to go to this option that says adjust desktop size and position and we want to make sure that we enable this option full screen, scaly mode full screen. Make sure you have this enabled. Then you hit apply and then you want to go to change resolution. And what are we going to do here? We So basically we're going to we're going to create a custom resolution in here. To do that, we'll, we're going to click on customize and create a custom resolution so before i go any further um i want to show you guys this tool right here i'm gonna leave a link in the description we're gonna use this to calculate the resolution that we are gonna put in here so let's say you want to play in 4x3 resolution and um in my case i have a 2k monitor so 4040p and i put it this in um, um, and it's gonna calculate the resolution that I'm gonna put here. So yeah, in my case, I gotta put this one resolution in here in the um, create a custom resolution. Let's say if you have like a 1080p monitor and you wanna play in 4x3, uh, you put you just simply put 1080 right here, in the, and this is the one resolution that you wanna put in here. So yeah, in my case it's 1440p, so 1440p is this one. And I'm just gonna put this in here and then you click on test. So I get this message because I already have the resolution in my in my computer. But like when you click on test and you create a new custom resolution, it's gonna test it and like it's gonna give you like a 20 seconds cooldown to like to make sure there, there is not any glitches in the resolution and like basically to make sure that your monitor can handle the custom resolution you're putting so yeah when you are done with that you're gonna click on yes 
and then you want to look for the resolution in here um, it should be in the top of in my case it's at the bottom I don't know why so yeah we're gonna say click apply it's gonna go black for like a second and then it's gonna ask me if I want to keep the resolution or not so yeah I click yes and then we tap back in the game again now with the custom resolution we can now notice that the black bars are gone and we are now playing in um, 4x3 so yeah now I'm gonna show you in a in a light ray the differences between the uh, native resolution and the 4x3 resolution so yeah right now I'm on the streets this is one, if not the most demanding map in the game, uh, FPS wise. Unlike, you can see my FPS right now, I have 90, um, 80, 87, 92, 94. I don't have any single drops and it works uh, perfect for me, this resolution. It's amazing. Unlike, if I switch back to my native resolution, my FPS are gonna like fucking die I'm gonna show you we change to the native resolution it doesn't matter I'm gonna let it on 4x3 um, you can see my FPS at 55 70 60 um, they, they are not stable as you can see those FPS drop can like mean the difference between winning or losing a PvP fight you know so yeah just changing the aspect ratio to 4x3 in the game is not gonna improve your FPS at all because what this does, it literally just zooms in your image but your the resolution that is in the game that the game is like rendering is still gonna be your native resolution so in my case, the game is rendering um, 2K right now even though I'm playing in 4x3 resolution so yeah, with, with the custom resolution we are fixing that and we are like cutting the pixels and like stretching them so like there is like less uh, work for the um, for the GPU so that way we get like more FPS you know the thing that I love about this resolution is that there is literally no difference in the video image the video quality between the native resolution and the custom resolution I'm gonna show you like when I when I'm recording for YouTube I play with aspect ratio 16 by 9 and I still I still keep the uh, custom resolution and it will be the same as a native um, 16 by by 9 it's gonna be the same as a native 16 by 9 resolution but like I will get like more FPS I'm gonna show you this is my custom resolution and now I'm gonna switch it to the uh, native one resolution and show you the difference so default right here this is default and boom it's literally the same image quality dude except uh, we're getting less FPS with this one because there is like more uh, pixels for the GPU to render and stuff you know I mean if you're picky enough you you might see like a slightly difference between the grass at the end because the other resolution is um, technically lower than this one so yeah that is the end of the video if you find it useful make sure to like and subscribe to my channel to help me grow and make more videos like this in the future um, if you need any help or you have any questions you can ask me in the comments and I will try to uh, respond to all of them so yeah I don't know keep swagging yeah see you